guys, we've got the Sig Sauer 1911 today, and this is the Emperor Scorpion Edition. So, roll the intro, get all the info, and then after, we we'll go for a shoot. Alright guys, how's it going? We've got the 6 hour 1911 Emperor Scorpion today, 4.5mm air pistol and high quality semi-automatic fully blowback air pistol that is designed to replicate the look, feel and performance of the classic 1911 handgun. The air pistol is made by one of the most respected firearm manufacturers in the world. It features a number of high-end components, a feature that makes it an excellent choice for shooting enthusiasts and also collect it so it has a realistic metal construction that gives it a weight and feel very similar to that of a real 1911 handgun it has a sleek fde finish that is accented with a stylish black grip that gives it a unique and eye-catching look the air pistol is powered by a 12 gram co2 cartridge that is housed in the grip of the gun it is smooth single action trigger that provides a crisp clean break and it shoots 4.5 millimeter steel bbs at speeds of up to 340 feet per second the gun also has a full size drop Free metal magazine that holds 16 BBs. Other features of the Sig 911 include a tactical rail for mounting accessories, adjustable rear sights, and a manual safety that provides an added level of security when handling the gun. Overall, the Sig Sauer 911 Emperor Scorpion is a top quality air pistol that is perfect for target shooting, thinking, and collecting. Its realistic construction, high end components, and attention to detail make it standout choice for anyone who is looking for a high performance air pistol that looks and feels like the real thing. Uh, the accessory rails, M1913, operating system CO2, caliber 4.5mm steel BBs, magazine capacity is 16, overall length is 8.7 inches, muscle velocity is up to 300 feet per second, CO2 cylinder size 12 gram, and the weight is 41.6 cs or 1.17 kg. All right, back to the video. So here we are, we'll set up the range. So SIG themselves say this is obviously a brilliant replica and it's even got the custom trigger and the custom hammer, the skeletonized one, which is um, exactly like the real one. And they're saying if it's a range day, if it's wet outside or anything like that, these are perfectly good just to get a feel for it and have a practice with it. Because you can actually own the real firearm, same as that. All right, so luckily we've got some nice weather. We've got the target set up and we've got the um, the can set up there. So yeah, let's get this thing loaded. All right, so this is 4.5 millimeter steel BBs. First things first, we're gonna take the mag out. We're gonna put the CO2 in, 12 gram CO2. Doesn't quite fit, so we're just gonna have to undo that a bit fit snug and then we're just going to tighten slowly like that you can add a little hiss all right make sure it's sealed put it up to your ear make sure there's nothing seeping out of there and you're good to go not too tight don't ruin the seals now we're going to load up the 16 rounds you can get speed loaders for these things we're just uh, slapping them through the top there Okay, and there we are, 16 in the mag, CO2 is in, and we're going to place this into the gun. Okay, and then it goes straight back now, so the, cam the hammer is cocked there, meaning you're good to go. So it will not fire until I turn the safety off, and I'm on the guard there, otherwise, look, you can turn that safety off, it will not fire. Off there, and then see if we can hit one in, yeah. First things first, we've got five cans in there. We're going to see if we can hit them off one shot each. And then with the rest of the rounds, we'll um, sling them into the target and we'll show you that blowback action and see if it locks back after the mag is spent. The blank target, so we'll show you it afterwards. You see that when the mag is spent, it holds back. That is so cool. Okay, let's have a look. All right, so not bad. Got a bit of a line there. <laughs> We're gonna refill the mag, move us back to 10 meters, and fire from a stable position and see what the accuracy we get out of the box there. All right, we are this far, which is 10 meters. Thank you. 
Can I just say, did you see the recoil on that? This is an Airsoft BB replica and it was actually kicking. And I haven't had a gun do that yet. <laughs> um, so aiming for the center, we're down and right a bit. So we've got the grouping all around there, aiming for that. Well, that was a, a 10 meter range. So all the way over there, you're hitting this circle here, like an inch or two. It's only the size of someone's heart from over there. So it's pretty damn good. This thing is absolutely awesome. The absolute replica, the way it goes back, the way it kicks, it's, I would say, worth the extra 100 from the P226 um, six hour but I'm loving it, all the features on it. Like I said, the skeletized trigger and hammer, the way it goes back is, is awesome. I actually, this is banging. This is probably my favorite one. Made by Sig themselves. My right, guys, just put some in the mag again. We're just gonna have a few shots from a few different angles and um, just use the CO2 that's in there basically. guys the six hour 1911 hope you've enjoyed it um let me know thoughts and feelings down below any other guns you want me to test out and stuff uh like and subscribe and i'll catch you next one peace